part of the reason why the sentence, or the guilty verdict was overturned by appeal, but Jonathan was found guilty again, and his original sentence was reinstated. <laughs> wow. But we're still not done. Because after Jonathan was in prison, Scott's family was like, um, wait one fucking minute. Jonathan may have pulled the trigger, but the defense just proved that a lot of other circumstances went into this murder, and they all started with the Jenny Jones show. So, in 1999, Scott's family sued the Jenny Jones show, Telepictures, and Warner Brothers, Warner Brothers who own all of the Jenny Jones show, oh. for ambush tactics and, as Scott's family considered it, their negligent actions that resulted in Scott's death. And in May of 1999, the jury awarded the family over $29 million. Mm -hmm. The fuck? The jury said that the Jenny Jones show was both irresponsible and negligent, contending that the show intentionally created an unpredictable situation without due concern for the possible consequences. Okay. That's a quote. I didn't okay. get to write that myself. <laughs> it's not just like you. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so this incident and trial also had a ripple effect throughout the talk show world. Yeah. Because at the time, a lot of the shows were like, I need to outdo this one and I yeah. need to outdo that one. And a bunch of them all cleaned up their act. All of a sudden, Montel Williams was like wearing a sweater vest in the same mm -hmm. national. And they're all doing this now. Montel. Montel. He's so good. <laughs> um, all of them except for the incomparable Jerry Springer, of course. Oh, I'm sorry. Just that one. That was like, his brand. Yeah, he couldn't say it worked out really well for him. Yeah, I mean, it just, he was not going to change. No. Also, the episode featuring Scott and Jonathan never aired. It was never actually put on TV okay. because it was, the episodes are all filmed a few days in advance so that way you can edit out curse words and like when people take their top off and yeah. people are out yeah. yes. all yeah. of that. So this happened three days after it was filmed, so the show was never aired. Yeah. However, despite all of this, the judgment for Scott's family in the 29 was later overturned by the Michigan Court of Appeals oh. in a two-to-one decision. And then the Michigan Supreme Court declined to hear the case. So I'm thinking that Scott's family didn't become millionaires. Huh. Yeah. Interesting. But they still had a victory because Jonathan Schmidt is in jail, right? And he was sentenced to 25 to 50 years in prison, which if he was 24, that could have reasonably been the end of his life. Right. Until it wasn't. Because on August 22nd, 2017, Jonathan was released 